Hey guys, kind of a different kind of video for you today. Uh, recently, I came to the realization that I am fat. I am way heavier than I used to be. Uh, 20 pounds, 30 pounds. Check out this picture of me shirtless from summer of 2013. And I was that week that uh, that picture was taken, I was running... 10 miles every day for six days in a row, and then on the seventh day, I ran 12 miles. Uh, and so obviously, right now I have the body of Winston Churchill. Um, so I decided, I've been doing some research, I am going to just not eat for seven days. Eight days, actually. Planning on eight. Um, I've got a boys' trip lined up to Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. Um, and... Yeah, so figured that'd be a good, uh, you know, motivating factor. I have eight days till we leave for the trip, so yeah. Anyway, this is going to be a straight water fast. Um, I am actually drinking carbonated water as well. Uh, that helps to fill up your stomach. Um, and I cannot eat for, you know, days at a time. I think the longest time I've gone without food is like four days. Um, so it's normally not a big deal for me, but yeah, only water. Uh, I also want this to kind of be a detox type thing. Um, a, a cleanse, I guess, if you're using the hipster verbiage. Um, so that means no coffee, uh, which I drink four to five cups of coffee every single day. Um, I love coffee. Um, but it's not a true water fast if you're drinking anything other than water. So, no coffee. However, I will utilize it. Uh, caffeine actually has an uh, appetite suppressant. It's an appetite suppressant. Uh, makes you not feel hungry. Um, so, if I find on day three or six or something that I'm feeling hungry, I'll uh, have a cup of coffee or something um, and see how that goes. Also, I uh, am not smoking any cigars during this time. I just want to see how my body reacts to only water. Uh, give all my organs a break, kind of an interior car wash, if you will. Uh, clean out my liver, uh, pancreas, everything. Um, but nicotine is actually also an appetite suppressant. And so again, if I feel like uh, I'm not going to make it or something, rather than breaking down the entire way, um, I will try to use caffeine and nicotine to my uh, advantage. But we'll see how this goes. I'll uh, post a picture um, every day. Um, I don't actually have a scale. I should have bought a scale for this. Anyway, <laughs> too late now. We are, let's see, three, 15 and a half hours, 16 hours into the fast than the first day. We're going from midnight the night before. Um, feeling good, a little bit uh, scatterbrained, I guess. Although that could be because I slept for eight and a half hours last night. And I normally get like two to four hours of sleep every night. Um, and uh, a perfect night's sleep for me would be six. Uh, if I sleep any more than that, I feel tired. Um, but recently I've just had so much to do that I've been sleeping like two, four hours and, you know, getting used to it. But I read that, uh, when you're fasting, it's good to sleep a lot more. Um, so my target right now is eight to nine hours ish. So that could be that I've changed my sleep schedule and that's why I feel sluggish. Um, a little bit hungry. Uh, I mean... That's routine more than anything. It's not that I'm, obviously I have calories to spare, but uh, yeah, I'll let you guys know on day two, uh, this is probably going to be the only video for today. So yeah, I'm going to fill up my stomach with some seltzer water. This is just carbonated water, uh, has CO2 and water in it. Purified water. All right, whatever. Yeah, so, also upping my water intake. 
uh, trying to drink at least three liters per day, not of this stuff, just of any water, um, so I can help flush the toxins out. And uh, I heard that uh, you should eat a little bit of salt, or not eat it, uh, dissolve it in some water to drink it, uh, so you don't get uh, sodium depletion. Uh, but thankfully, this stuff has 10 milligrams of sodium per serving, so I don't know what that's from. Uh, but it has no calories, so that's the main thing. Um, but anyway, yeah, hopefully I uh, can, you know, use this to kick off getting my six-pack back, because I miss it. I like money, you know, and you have to work a lot and sit at a desk a lot of the time so you don't get exercise when you're building a business, uh, which I think is more important than health, short-term. But long-term health is of the utmost importance. So I'll catch you guys tomorrow and let you know how I feel.